Ed is over there. I'm going to wait for him to finish talking to someone and see. Everything is done in a doctor. That must be a very meditative sort very, of yeah, quiet process. process. Yeah. Do you listen to music or anything? I listen to jazz. And all these were just like cut paper with different metallic, silver, blue, red, and all that would give me the tones of a so black and white. many exposures? Well, when I first started off with about maybe, I went to about 20 sheets of paper. Now I could get it down to three, three sheets. <laughs> yeah, Great. So. What, do you often run into like, surprises in the imagery that All of comes these, out of yeah, it? Yeah, I, I don't really see a negative. I don't use the negative. Mm -hmm. I don't use a camera. So everything is sitting on top of the photo paper. Mm -hmm. I don't see until we go into the developer. That must be an exciting oh, process. Oh, yeah, it looks like, yeah, I mean, I, I listen to the jazz music and I can see the thing come up. You know. So, the, have, so these are, this is paper set vertically and the lights come down like this. And, and it's sitting in on my enlarger. So but it's I like a, I, I a topographic. Use, I don't use an enlarger. I use a little black box that I built with a real stack. Oh, wow. And then I can control the light. What? It almost like painting. You know, okay, so you can control whether the light hits by one point or the yeah. other. In other words, say like you know, if I had the paper like this, I go like this, and I go like you know, it's like painting, you know, like a paintbrush. Are you a painter as well? Or no, in the past, no, no, in the past no. Have you made other I studied photography in Rhode Island, so I just became with that, you know. I've, in the past, did you used to work with cameras and? I still, you know, I still do. I, oh, okay. I, I, I this got is a, I still do four work. by five and all that, eight oh, by great. ten pin holes and stuff. Yeah. Are there some other artists that you like whose work you look at that also work with well, cameras? Well, yeah, Man Ray, you mm -hmm. know. But I look at his stuff and I didn't want to copy his stuff because his stuff was like. Most of it, you, you could see the, the silhouette of his the stuff. objects, more like documents or right, something. Right, and I didn't want to do that, so I figured, how can I start doing it? So then I, in my studio downstairs in my house, I had some colored paper. And if I start building stuff like that, then it, be, it becomes something else. So, you know. do, do you find when people look at them that they often are trying to find, like, like figure it out, you know what I mean? Oh yeah, some got yeah. figured, you know, some... <laughs> they figure it out, they Yeah, get some it. got figured, but, but I don't see it until I actually develop it. You know, like... They're sort of enigmatic in right. that way. It's fun, I mean, it's, wow, it, it is, you know? Have you worked in larger formats, or is this sort of a standard size? Well, I shoot with a four... These are smaller. Well, those are the same document with smaller prints. Because mm -hmm. potentially I, you could work... And all scales. Oh, all I can scales. make 16 by 20, but it, yeah. it, the paper that you know, costs money now, you know? Yeah. yeah. 
I did make I did make one 16 by 20. Uh -huh. it, it was nice. I still got it, but cool. if I did, if I had did the whole exhibit, that would cost a fortune. Mm -hmm. Have you been? How, how long have you been doing this sort of 40, process? Forty. Forty years. Forty years. Wow. Have they? Do you think they've been received differently over time? Yeah. I first started off doing still life and landscapes, and then I think I got to do something like everybody else. So I start doing stuff like that. And, you know, I still go out and do landscapes. I still do still life. Wonderful. Thanks so much for sharing. Thank you. Yeah. Um, well, we're going to spend some more time in the show. If we think of some other questions, do you mind if we grab you? Sure. <laughs> we want, sure. I'd like to spend some more time looking at it. Okay. Thank you, Ed. Thank you. Well, that was Ed Lose here. We're at his art exhibit, the Forbes Library here in Northampton. He just shared some insight about how his pr he came to make these prints about 40 years ago, and it was nice to talk to Ed. Beautiful.